we always refer to soil quality, not soil health. That's because we saw it from the perspective of chemistry and physics with some life in there, but the life was something that we really hadn't focused on and we really didn't understand well. Well, since that, those early days, this is going back 50 years or so, we have shifted and now you go to the U.S. Department of Agriculture's website and you type in healthy soils, you'll be brought to an entire section of website describing exactly what I'm talking about. Treating our soils as living ecosystems and doing everything we can to understand what that life is and how we manage and we coexist with it and we leverage it, if you will, to provide us a healthy plant. You cannot have healthy plants if you don't have the healthy soil to support the development of that plant. And that's what we mean when we say a plant or a garden is healthy, is that everything is functioning and all of these organisms and that livestock in the soil, and it truly is livestock. Another term they use for it is the soil food web, the network of living organisms in the soil that are releasing and making available to the plant what it needs to be healthy and energetic and produce what we hope it will produce to support us.